My name is Stuart Perry. I have uh, type 2 diabetes. I have been a diabetes advocate for uh, ever since I uh, was diagnosed, which was over 30 years ago. We call diabetes the, the family curse in my family. Uh, my father has type 2 diabetes and is on insulin. My mother, I grew up with my grandmother, her boiling needles. The sheer technology in how you treat somebody and the tools we have to treat it have made having diabetes not something that you have to look at as a death warrant. It means having diabetes is something that has to be managed. You have to have the tools, have to have access to the tools in order to manage your diabetes. And not everybody does that. My family is blessed because we earn a good living and we have enough money to pay for our medical bills and pay for the things we need to manage our disease. Not everybody has that. So it's up to us that have it to be an advocate for those that either can't, won't, or don't know how to advocate for themselves. The question gets asked of me a lot is, my child was just diagnosed, what do I do? I normally tell them the story about a gentleman from Kentucky who was the co-chair of the Diabetes Caucus in Congress. He told me a story about a young man and his family who came in to see him, and that young man got out his meter, pricked his finger, gave himself an insulin shot right there in front of the congressman. He showed two days in his life to that congressman and explained to him what it was like, an eight-year-old kid. Not only did he get involved in the bill that they were asking him for, he became co-chair of the Diabetes Caucus. That's the power of telling stories. You have to exercise your right to stand up and be counted for what's important. Type two, type one, gestational, prediabetes, everybody has to stand up. Whether you're taking insulin, whether you're not taking insulin, you've got to stand up and do something to make sure that we can either A, prevent this disease, eradicate this disease, and make sure that we have the tools necessary to combat this disease. So stand up.